Chapel Hill, the home of number one ranked North Carolina. A crowd of more than 22,000 is on hand to watch the Tar Heels take on the Maryland Terrapins. The two senior coaches in the ACC, a matchup where Dean leads lefty 26-7, but that's not the whole story. Some of those losses have been oh so close, like 83 in Carmichael. Let's reset the stage for you. It's North Carolina 72, Maryland 71. The Terps with the basketball, five seconds left. Adkins to Chuck Drizel. Drizel drives the baseline, it's blocked. Ball's out of bounds, there's no time left on the clock. That was 1983. Two years ago, it wasn't that close. The great Michael Jordan finished off the College Park encounter with a 74-62 Carolina win. Then 85, Carolina's Curtis Hunter applied the final nail in the coffin as the Tar Heels scored six straight points to come from behind and steal another victory from the upset-minded Terrapins. Earlier this year in College Park, Maryland was playing superbly at home and it looked like they had it in the bag, leading by nine with 11 minutes to go. But things started to unravel and the Tar Heels staged another brilliant comeback for a 71-67 victory. Tonight, Carolina will try to maintain its dominance while Maryland goes for the upset, live from the Smith Center. Raycom Sports and Jefferson Pilot Teleproductions present exclusive live coverage of Atlantic Coast Conference basketball. Tonight, live from the Dean Smith Student Activity Center in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, the Maryland Terrapins take on the University of North Carolina Tar Heels. Tonight's game is being brought to you by Piedmont Airlines, NCNB, the Jefferson Pilot Companies, Natural Light, South Carolina National, Subaru, Food Lion, Gillette, and by Central Fidelity. Maryland and North Carolina from the Smith Center in Chapel Hill. Good evening, everybody. I'm Mike Patrick, along with Dan Bonner, and it's great to have you with us for Atlantic Coast Conference basketball tonight. Today marks the end of an era here in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, as the North Carolina State Wolfpack meet the number one ranked North Carolina Tar Heels in this, the last game ever in Carmichael Auditorium. The first game at Carmichael was in 1966, with Bob Lewis scoring the first basket in a win over William & Mary. Last February, North Carolina fans thought they'd seen their last game here at Chapel Hill's Carmichael Auditorium when the Tar Heels defeated Cliff Ellis and his Clemson Tigers. As it turns out, however, today is a day that it all comes to an end. North Carolina, undefeated and ranked number one of the nation, has been led in the inside by senior Brad Doherty, an All-American candidate. Doherty has led the team in scoring with an average of 17.9 and is shooting from the field a blistering 68.9%. That's best in the Atlantic Coast Conference. Taking care of matters from the outside is a job of Kenny Smith, one of the top point guards in the nation. Also a double-figure score at 11.8. The junior from New York City ranks him among the conference leaders in assists with an average of 6.1 per game. They've been the headliners for a team that has scored over 100 points seven times in 13 games. North Carolina State, after some early problems, has seemingly gotten it all together. An eight and three record overall with five of the wins coming in a row, including this one against Nevada Las Vegas in the title game of the Chaminade Classic. Part of the reason for the turnaround has been the recent steady play of guard Ernie Myers, one of only two seniors on the young NC State team. Another part, and a big one, is named Chris Washburn. The six foot 11 inch sophomore has been every bit the player the experts thought he would be with his scoring and rebounding inside. He's been the main cog in this Wolfpack early season success story, one that coach Jim Balbano and his team hopes to continue here today, weaving his magic again in leading the Wolfpack to a win in his final game at Carmichael Auditorium. It's the North Carolina State Wolfpack against the Tar Heels of North Carolina, live coming up next from Carmichael Auditorium. Raycom Sports and Jefferson Pilot Teleproductions present exclusive live coverage of Atlantic Coast Conference basketball. Today, live from Carmichael Auditorium in Chapel Hill, North Carolina, the NC State Wolfpack challenges the Tar Heels from North Carolina. 
Today's game is being brought to you by Natural Light, NCNB, Piedmont Airlines, the Jefferson Pilot Companies, South Carolina National, Subaru, Food Lion, and Central Fidelity. Good afternoon, everyone, and welcome to Carmichael Auditorium here in Chapel Hill, where today they close the book on an era of unparalleled success in North Carolina basketball.